Hey guys, this is Swanton Girlie. Um, I was supposed to record this last week, but um, or earlier on this week, but I didn't get any chance because I started uni on Monday, and it's been all over the place. Um, I don't start classes till this Monday, but still, I've been getting stuff sorted out and trying to get everywhere before I finally get into my timetable and stuff. But this is gonna be my last top five. Um, it was by far the toughest of my top five things, so. I actually have to get my list. Um, if you haven't guessed by now, this is my top five figures. Now everyone knows on here that I'm a very, very big figure collector. I love my figures and I've got so many of them and they're all in their boxes and all this. So this was especially tough for me. Um, so instead of it being my top five, well, it is still my top five, but I've got four honorable mentions this time because I love all my figures so much and it was so hard to pick my top five and I know there's so many more coming out but this is my top five from my collection which I have in my cupboard in the other room. So I'll start off with my honourable mentions and um, this is one of my first honourable mentions. Love this figure. This is the Bret Hart Final Aggression. It's so cute. It's got the wee glasses and all. I don't know whether to take I mean Bret Hart in a couple of weeks and I don't know whether to take this and get signed or to take my classic superstars figure. I'm gonna to have to think if any of you um want to opinion opinion ah <laughs> um if anyone of you want to help me out with that um classic superstars or this one to get signed so um please let me know as soon as possible um but yes he's got his glasses and he's got a wee leather jacket on in there so it's very cute so that's one of my favorite, favorite figures um we'll go for this one next. This is my second honourable mention, um, it's my Beth Phoenix Maria limited um, edition figure set. Um, I love Maria and Beth, I love the Divas. This was um, a rare set I got um, when I first started collecting and uh, it was very pretty and um, there's the belt, the women's championship belt and Maria, I miss Maria. But yes, that's that one. So that's my second honourable mention. I'm just going to set them all here. Oh my word. Um, my third one, this is actually one of the first figures I ever got. Um, I remember seeing it and picking it up. This is um, the Trish Stratus Classic Superstars, but it's the LYN, I think it's they're called, or LJ, LJN. Um, but I absolutely love this. These ones, you can't move. They stay in the same position the whole time. But I absolutely adore this one because it's Trish Stratus. So I think it's very, very pretty. And she's got her 100% um, babe on her top there and her trousers. So that's definitely one of my own mentions. It just missed out on my top five. And my last arm mention, I'm sure you've seen this before, is the Shawn Michaels limited edition exclusive where he's got all of his belts. And my belts, one, two, three, four, five. Five belts. So yes, that is my fifth. Um, my last honourable mention. I love all those. Now, I've put these in the wrong order now, but here we go. Um, this is my top five now. This was so, so hard, guys. You don't know how hard this was for me with all these new ones coming out and stuff. But these are my top five. Um, I'll sell them these and these will do. Um, my number five is my CM Punk Over the Limit. I like this one um, because of the G.I. Joe theme and it's got him with his beard and his tattoos and his hairy chest. Um, definitely I thought I love CM Punk in this night. Um, CM Punk as you know is one of my favourites so I definitely had to have him in my top five and this is my favourite figure of his so far. Um, I'll probably be getting a new one coming out soon, which will probably then replace this one in my top five, but so far this is my top five. So that's number five, CM Punk Over The Limit. Um, number four is my boy Finlay, and it is his elite figure from series four. Um, I love this figure, I remember him wearing this for um, his Wrestlemania um, Belfast Brawl. I thought that was awesome. Um, probably because it said Belfast Brawl, I was like, yes, Belfast. Um, but um, there he's got Shalili and he's got his awesome jacket with the spikes in this side and long sleeve in this side. This is, the elites are so good. I love the elite figures. Um, 
you can't fault them, they're amazing. Um, I absolutely adore what they put in each Elite figure, do the shirts and all the different outfits and things you can get with them. I absolutely love them. So yes, this is my number four and it's Finley. Um, number three, number three, um, is this one and it's Undertaker, one of 3,000. I love my one of 3,000s, so I've got a couple, um, but this is definitely one of my favourites. Um, it's, it's very heavy actually, I don't know whether, if anyone's got any of this, they'll probably know the same thing, but it is very heavy. He's wearing his, um, his cloak or his trench coat, um, he's got his urn down there and his belt here and his hat up there. And this is, I love this figure, um, Undertaker is definitely one of my favourite superstars um, and who can fall to one of 3000 so um, it'd be cool if they had like the number on each one but um, no it's just one of 3000 so all I know is that I've got one of the 3000 that these are like. But this, I love this figure, I think it's very detailed, I love it, it's very good. So that's my number three, um, my number two I got recently. And it's this, <laughs> my series um, 11 double pack of Cody Rhodes and Drew McIntyre. We can all tell why I like this one and why it's my number two, because it has Cody Rhodes in it. No, um, I like this one because it's one of the newer ones. Um, I've only got, CM Punk was probably the newest one there. So definitely I like this, I like um, the packs that come out with the packaging in this. And I like how they bring in like the new guys, like Cody and stuff. And all their new outfits. So yes, this is my number two. Love this figure. Drew's outfit's very nice in this one. The red with the Scottish flags and everything. Um, so yes, number two. And finally, we're up to my number one. Now, my number was very hard. Um, there's a couple of running for number one and um, the last five, Joe, they were tough to decide as well. But um, yes, this is my favorite. Um, just because, <laughs> but um, yes, my favourite is, it's my number one and it's my Edge Classic Superstar 1 of 3000 Toy Fair magazine exclusive. I absolutely adore this figure, it's at the front of my cupboard, I don't know where you've seen it in videos but it is up there. Um, I love the detail in this, I love the belt, the belt is one of my favourite things in that one. Um, the trench coat is awesome. I know there's an elite figure probably coming out of this soon, of Edge or some new Mattel figure, but I absolutely adore this one. Jack's Classic Superstar, that was my favourite. Um, when Jack's were doing WWE Classic Superstars were the thing I collected. I loved the Classic Superstars. So it was um, nice to see an Edge exclusive out there. Um, I absolutely adore this one. Um, so yes, that's my number one. And it has the back and it has him with the belt. So yes guys, that's my top five. Um, I love my top five. Um, it'll probably change so much as new things come out. But that at the moment is my top five figures. Um, any figure collectors out there, I'd love to hear your top five figures. Um, it's so hard, believe me, see if you've got as many figures as me. It's so hard just to pick your top five and just leave it that but um alas it's my top five so um CM Punk over Limit Finley Elite Undertaker one of three thousand Cody and Drew double pack and Edge one of three thousand and then my honourable mentions um I had to put the honourable mentions in there because there's just so many figures that I like and all that and one on the subject of figures I picked up this one two days ago um, it's Evan Bourne series 12, there was only one of him and um, funny story, I had to actually race someone to get it, <laughs> that was a fun day, um, had to race, um, I saw it and I couldn't reach it, it was on the very very top shelf so I asked mum to go get a guy to go get it and the woman with her two overexcited cheeky wee brats <laughs> decided um, that they wanted it um, even though I was very quiet and I was telling my mum <laughs> and she, well she wasn't, she was smaller than me and she tried to 
and while my mum was away getting the guy, um, she tried to stand up on one of the shelves and reach up and try and get it. But unfortunately she was too small and couldn't reach it. Um, so the guy came and got it for me. And the wee kids were like giving me these glares. I was like, oh, I really wanted them born because um, they didn't have any of them. And I just saw that at the very, very back, which is very lucky for me. It sold out really quickly when I'm born. So I love them born. This is my first ever born figure. I'm very happy with it. So yes, and I also got Wade Bart. Series 12, but he is in my cupboard, so um, I'll maybe show him another time. Um, oh, she's fun. So yes guys, thank you very much. If you just want to do a video response or even just comment on this, <laughs> it'd be very nice. Um, so yes, let me know and thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you soon. Bye!